Hey, Soulages, and welcome to another episode of A Moment with Mate, the hair edition. Now, this is the same hair edition from the Wavy Traditions hair that I had previously, but except this time, I added a closure. So, before I even get started, I have to apologize to all my Soulages out there. I know I sound like Kermit the Frog. I sound absolutely disgusting. These allergies are kicking my butt, y'all. I can't. Like, I can't even breathe, but... Nonetheless, a promise is a promise, and I promised my vendor that I would have this done by today, and, well, I'm here. Due to my allergies, I can't be back to the back row of the church, so I decided to just look like I feel great. I feel like crap, but at least I looked the part. Hmm. So, on to the hair. Um, this is the same exact hair that I've had. It's the wavytraditions.com hair. It's the Brazilian straight. I have in four bundles and a closure. I have a 30 inch, a 28 inch, a 26 inch, a 24 inch, and a 22 inch closure. So, let me give you all the tea. I previously had my hair installed and I tried to do a leave out with the keratin treatment. Well, you know, me having the luck I have, it never works. My hair is just super de duper curly and it does what it want to do. So, I was finding myself like flat out in my hair every day. And I was just going to burn it out. So I said, you know what? I went back to my stylist and I said, you know what? This isn't going to work. I'm going back to my closure. Previously, I had some issues with some closures because the glue that I was using, the methods that I was trying. Now, the methods were on point. They just weren't for me. She knew exactly what she was doing. They worked for some people, but it, it wasn't quite the look I was going for. So I said, okay, I'm going to have to get this thing down to a science. So... I said, okay, so we tried the keratin treatment, and we tried, um, you know, the leave out, and I was just going to burn my hair out, like I said. So, I contacted Wave of Traditions, and I requested a closure, and within three to four, I think, business days, I had this beautiful 22-inch um, Brazilian straight closure. So, I was very excited because I've never had um, a closure that really laid like this except my Sheena's hair emporium closure that was amazing as well but I think this one is Swiss lace um so uh I just got it installed and I know you guys want to know the secret to exactly how I get it this flat well um I used ghost bond glue um ghost bond glue is this little capsule right here I don't know if you can see that can you see that? Hopefully you can. Ghost bond. And it is a glue that you use to adhere your front laces, your closures, your um, frontals, things of that nature down. I previously tried some 30 second dry quick glue and it was absolutely disgusting. It was like the worst experience I've ever experienced. I had to glue my um, closure down like every two days and oh, just disgusting. This, this is my life, y'all. I promise. Ghost Bond is everything I've ever needed. So what you do is you use this, and you only use a little bit. You do four coats. You have to follow the directions to the T, or it will not work. You do three coats. You let it dry clear each time, and then the fourth coat, you let it stay on for seven minutes. After the seven minutes, you put your closure, your frontal, your lace wig, whatever you want to use on, and you press it down, and then you go into your closure, and you press down with the back of a comb, like I'm showing you. Look, you're not going to make me mess my hair trying to demonstrate. Because he's sitting, even though I feel a mess, but hmm, enough about that. So, that's what I do, and after I glue my closure down, I tie it down, and let it stay there for at least a few hours. And um, just let it, what they call cure. Now, with the curing process, honey, I had no clue that curing got as tight as it did when it's curing y'all this thing gets so tight to your head but it's not uncomfortable but you just know she's on there to stay so i do that and that is the secret to my madness this ghost bond um like i said the 30 second glue it was absolutely preposterous and i would not suggest you go out and spend your money on that because it doesn't work this um my closure was staying there for about a week um, I have very oily skin, so that kind of prohibits the glue from 
you know, stay in the hair a little bit longer. But I don't mind it. Every week I wash my hair. I try to anyway, at least co-wash it. And I just reinstall my, um, well, not reinstall. I re-glue my closure down. Um, every hairstylist is different. I hope that yours does it right. Um, but like I said, as long as you follow those instructions and, you know, you do what you're supposed to do, then you'll be fine. Um, as far as the upkeep, like I said, minimum shedding. Still no tangling. None at all. And um, everything is just working out perfect. I absolutely love this hair. Um, I want to switch it up for y'all today because I know y'all used to seeing me either with, you know, it just bone straight with a bust down the middle, honey. Oh, nasty bust down the middle. Or, you know, some other shindig. But I said today I'm going to switch it up give an ode to Marilyn Monroe. Do a little Hollywood. Mm hmm. Yes, honey, this front is giving me life, baby. So, um, like I said, I have a 30 inch, a 28, a 26, and a 24. Y'all, she has the deals of your life. You need to go check out wavytraditions.com and get you some hair. Remember, I always say when you cut corners, corners cut you. Um, it's an investment, but her prices are so low, you don't even look at it as an investment. You just look at it as like, damn, why is this hair so cheap? But it's not cheap because, like I said in a previous video, she's about quality over quantity. So even if she has to take somewhat of a pay cut just to make sure that her clients are getting the best hair that they could possibly get, then, hey, that's the type of person she is. And, I mean, what better type of hair company could you ask for? Um, any problems that I have, I can call her 24 hours a day. I can contact Wave of Traditions and she answers them. You know, she gives me product advice and, you know, um, she got some really, really exciting things coming out um, this summer. Um, check out her Cambodian Curly. I think Miss Redbone um, reviewed the Cambodian Curly. And it's another young lady. And I want to say her name is Keisha. Hey, y'all. We're the Wavy Traditions family. Hey. Um, shout out to um, the owner. Of Wave of Traditions. Hey, LaRonda girl. What's going on? Hi, um, major shout out to my stylist, Crystal. Y'all can find her on Instagram at Styles by Crystal. Y'all can find her on Facebook at Crystal Saunders. That's K-R-Y-S-T-L-E. Saunders. Saunders. You get it? Saunders. I know. I would be having blonde moments with her name. I don't know why. Because, you know, she's just sis Chris to me. But anyway... So, I just want to do this video and just do an update. I've had this hair about, I went to New York in the end of March, and it's now May, and I still haven't had no problems. Um, I got the hair reinstalled, um, and it's holding up perfectly fine. You see, I go right through it. It holds curls really well. Um, I used the Conair um, Titanium 1-inch Barrel Curl Curler. Um, the only thing that I use in my hair is argon oil, and I use less than a dime size of that. And for shine, I use, um, well, for heat protection, I use the Beyond the Zone um, Turn Up the Heat. It's an orange bottle, and I sometimes just spray that just for shine because I don't like my hair goopy with a lot of product in it. So I can use it for light mist. It smells amazing, and hey, you're just going about your business. Um... So, if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below. If it's on Facebook, you can hit me up, inbox me. I think I pretty much covered everything. Um, I told y'all my secret. Now, go get your life. Um, and I love you guys so much. Um, I'm about to go in here and get drugged and sedated yet again because, like I said, these um, allergies are kicking my behind. I'm trying to do better with cussing, but it's not working so well, but... Just for the sake of this video, being that it is a professional endorsement and it is a professional um, advertisement for someone else's business, I don't want to be rude and just cussing all over the place, but y'all know I got a trash in my mouth, honey. Ooh, I can cuss like a drunken sailor, baby. Like that. Well, enough playing in my hair. I just want you to get into it. That's my closure. And I want y'all to see my eye. It looks disgusting. And this is my hair. All four bundles and a closure. It's much more fuller if I pull the other side around this way. But I kind of want to do this little one side thing like that. Just like that. Don't you do that like that. I love you guys so much for what. Um, 
I totally messed it up. I love you guys so much for watching. And like I said, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, you can hit me back. And I'm currently having, yeah, wardrobe malfunctions. Yeah, it must be time to end the video. I love you guys. See you later. As long as you love music, as long as you love makeup, as long as you love the truth, honey, you'll love me. Bye.